Today, I want to introduce you our famous dish, Kung Pao Chicken. Do you know most of the Kung Pao Chicken served here are tasted differently with the dish cooked in China? If you want to cook the traditional Kung Pao Chicken, click here and watch the video. It's yummy! First, prepare some chicken. Chop the chicken into small pieces. It doesn't matter if it is chicken breast or chicken drumsticks. And also prepare the cucumber, onion, and roasted peanuts. I got the roasted peanuts from Costco. For this dish, you need a spicy bean sauce. It's called Pijian bean sauce. It brings a spicy flavor into the dish, and you can find it in the local Chinese store. And also, you need a lot of sugar, and the sugar is the key for this dish. Pour the cooking oil into the pot, and turn on the stove to the low position. Wait for 3 minutes, add the chicken into the pot, and start stirring fry. bean sauce completely dissolved in the cooking oil. And now the color looks right, and those bubbles are actually from the melted sugar. And now add the cucumbers and peanuts. Stir in fry and mix all of them well. Prepare the starch to dissolve the water. It can help the meat looks shiny and smoothy. But don't directly add the starch powder to the pot because the powder will become jelly when it meets heat. Keep stirring fry, and if you want it more spicy, you can add red pepper or red pepper powder at this step. Now the dish is done. It is a very beautiful and yummy dish. The traditional way of eating Kung Pao chicken is with the steamed rice. Try it! So yummy! I can smell it! Try it!